Elder, thank you for yesterday <laughs> and the ceremony. And the gift that I gave you, as meager as it was, was from my heart. And uh, my intent was to represent the gift of uh, the earth with the rocks, the wind with the feather, and the fire with the incense. Uh, the feather was the gift of flight, the most magnificent thing that I've ever witnessed here in my existence. And it comes from my friend here, Pharaoh. Here, you can see him here. Yeah. Say hey. <laughs> He's normally more talkative. Anyway, uh, the stones. There was a smaller stone, and it has a couple of little ridges on it. And that stone came to my attention in Saudi Arabia. And I was in the city of Dahran, and in the marketplace. And in that marketplace, there was a vendor out, and he had a, a, a thing of lamb, and it was it was on a spit. And people would come up, and he would shave off some lamb onto what looked like pita bread or naan bread. And it was just the best stuff. And I saw that stone and it caught my attention. And so I saved it. And to me, it represents uh, all of the years and the witness of the life in that city. And the people who came through that city. So it's there for you. Yeah, I hope it brings you some joy as it brought me. Uh, the larger stone I got from Melbourne, Australia. And it was a local guy, a black guy. They call them Aborigines. But he was just a guy. Okay, and he came to me and said I was the first black man that he had met that was from another place other than his. And he gave that to me as a gift for what he thought was my courage to travel so far. And I honored that. And I give that to you to honor you and your courage for speaking your truth and helping the way you do. So, and my incense, which represents fire. Now that comes from a tree in Senegal. It is the Santan tree. The Santan tree grows on the Gambia River and is hundreds of years old before it starts really getting good. So that smell, I'm hoping that when you and Alda have time to relax and enjoy, I hope that the spirits from those trees and all of those years and our ancestors uh, serve you. I hope those smells talk to you like this from the spirits. So that my, was my intent with that. And again, I thank the two of you, me and Pharaoh here, because Pharaoh is from the, the bird clan, and he has been my teacher for the last 10 years. So he's taught me many things. So uh, from myself and Olivia, again, we thank you. You honor us, and we wish you well. Thank you.